Alright, what's good YouTube? You feel me? It's not kids back with another video. And today we're going to be doing a unboxing video. Some of this stuff is slightly open. Um, some of it is not open. So yeah. Right now we are in my barber room, you could say, of the house. You feel me? I will show y'all what the room looks like, how everything is set up. Once we done unboxing everything and we get everything hooked up, we have these Anis T outliners. We got these right here, still in the box. We got the whoa, we got the Anis Masters right here in the box. Um, and then we got a couple more things that um are in this box right here. The box is open, but nothing else is open inside the box. So. Yeah, I just had to make sure it was mine, you feel me? Because a lot of stuff coming in this house. So, so right here we have the Anis Masters. Now, y'all a barber or have, you know, seen y'all barber use this. Y'all know these are really nice. Um, this is how it comes in the box. It comes with clipper oil. It comes with this little thing, a clipper oil right here but i have my own clip oil got it off amazon um i'm thinking about getting um some things that go around the clippers like um it's like a headband for the clippers basically so that it won't be so slippery and i'll be able to control it more but yeah that's what we got so far this is garbage and then we have the Anis T outliners right here come in another little tray all right this is how they look right here you know what i mean make sure y'all follow me on instagram at j um cuts dot hair j cuts hair with a z you feel me? So y'all can book an appointment. I'm in Chicago. I'm not in no other city. I'm in Chicago and Chicago only. Next, we have... Next, we have the Andes Clipper Guards. These, I already, like, popped them open or whatever. But these are the Andes Clipper Guards for the Andes Masters. Because you have to buy your own. They don't come with guards. These are the premium guard sets. Um... These are metal. They cost me like 24 bucks or 20 bucks, something like that. But yeah, I the only guard that I don't have in this set right now is a one and a half guard. I don't have a I don't have a one and a half guard, but I do have a zero guard, so it'll be fine. The one and a half guard is really just to soften up the line. And the zero guard is really to take it out, so I'll be fine. We got the one guard, the two guard, the three guard, the four guard, the six, and the eight guard. So, those are my guards. Next, we have... Next, we have the Sanix, uh neck strips. Uh, I only got a pack of two. Just because I didn't want to get a pack of six and then, you know, it just be sitting around. So, when I need more, I will buy more. You feel me? But I want to start off with two for now. Um, Next, we have a barber pencil. All right. Um, we have... We have the Tresemme hairspray. Uh, extra hold. All right, this is for like you brush down the line and you spray a little bit of this on there, and then you get the blow dryer, cool shot, blow dry it, make sure it's done, and then you take the, cl the clippers, boom, boom, boom. You know what I mean? Or you know what I'm saying? At the end of a cut, you can spray this on, make sure that the hair don't move after your cut. So I got this, and then lastly. We have these Derby Premium uh, Razor Blades. 
right? Derby Premium Laser Blade Razor Blades. There's a hundred in here, and this small little bitty pack. There's a hundred. Um. I will take one out and show you. So this is my razor right here. As you can see, there's already a blade in here. So all you gotta do to take it out is just pull it out like that. And now there's this, right? Um. Anyways, that is everything that I bought that was given to me. You know what I mean? Next thing that I wanna get, I wanna get some hair products. Um, I do have a little bit of hair products. I got this pomade, but you know what I'm saying? This is for like a waiver that come in that's been woofing for like some months. And they wanna keep going, but they wanna, you know, a fresh cut, you feel me? But they wanna keep their length on top. Then this will this come in at. Type of chair, y'all. So now I'm gonna give y'all a little tour of everything. Mind y'all, um the day that I did, you know, clean everything up, get everything in place, it was a lot cleaner up in here. But it has been like a week since then. So it is like a little bit of garbage up here and stuff like that, but it's all good, you know what I mean? It's a bunch of garbage. It's a bunch of garbage. But it's fine. A bunch of boxes, you know what I mean, from packages and stuff. So that just means we getting busy. You feel me? That's all that means. We just that just means we getting busy, folks. You feel me? But right now I'm gonna cut the camera, show y'all the, the room that I'm working with. Alright, so I do have one more package. I do have one more package, but it's not barber related. Um, this I bought just for me. You feel me? Bought me some some white tees. You feel me? You can't go wrong with no white tees. You know what I mean? Pack of three. Definitely gonna buy. Gonna be buying me some. All right, y'all. So they got my heater right in there because it is cold back here. But once the summer hit, I will be changing that out for a fan. This is my desk area that I just had y'all sitting on. Um, when I'm not using my clippers or trying to clean them or fix them up or whatever, this is going to be where they be at. Um, the guards, everything, my water bottle. That is garbage over there. You got the cool care. This is the broken pencil sharpener that I, th that I thought I was going to need, as I told y'all before. Um, these are the second pair of clippers that I have. Um, I don't think you guys ever saw these, but I got these around Christmas time because I needed some new clippers and some different guards. Got these from Walmart. These were the first pair of clippers that I ever got. Um, this is the one that I cut my hair with first. So, yeah, won't be needing those anymore. Those probably going to storage or something like that. Keep it for, you know, good luck or something. I don't know. But yeah, so I have this little rolly thing over here. It's like a rolling stand where I will keep all my products at. And when I'm using my clippers, my clippers will be in here. So then when I'm cutting hair, you know what I mean? Cut, cut, cut. Put it down. Switch out. You know what I mean? Boom, boom, boom. Put it down. Roll it around. You know what I mean? Whatever I need to do. And then also... While I'm cutting hair, the guards that I need will be right here for for easy access. It will be right there for easy access, moving around, whatever I need to do, you know. That will be over there. My fade brush, comb, all that stuff will be over there. This will probably stay right here. Cool care, all this extra stuff will probably stay right here. Neck strips, everything that I don't use during a haircut will be on this table right here. They, this is the barber chair right here. Um, I want to save up money and buy a new one that reclines, but you know, those are like a thousand some bucks, you know what I mean? So this is gonna work for now. Um, we got the big mirror, but this is pretty much it, you feel me? We got a garbage can, broom over there, but this is it. This is my barber studio, barber room. 
whatever y'all want to call it. Um, but yeah, I think I think it looks really nice if I do say so myself, which I do. But yeah, man, like I was saying, make sure y'all go on Instagram at J Cuts Hair. Book y'all an appointment. Get this free haircut in. You feel me? You can't knock it till you try. It, you feel me? Y'all don't know what I'm capable of, capable of doing. Y'all see the stuff that I'm getting. Y'all see the work that I'm putting in. You feel me? I'm doing research on barbering. I'm watching YouTube videos. I'm doing this. I'm doing that. You know what I mean? I'm trying. You feel me? You can't say that I'm going to mess you up before I even cut your hair. You can't say that you don't want to go out looking bald when I haven't cut your hair. Alright? But... I'm trying to become a barber. I cannot be a barber without any clients. And I cannot just keep posting myself on my Instagram when I'm trying to show people what I can do. I need to build a portfolio. You know what I mean? So, just think of that. Like, what's, what's the worst that can happen? I mess your hair up? Okay. Wear a hat. Put a hood on. Put a do-rag on. And that's just the worst that can happen. The worst. The absolute worst. Like, y'all act like some females when they come to y'all hair. Like, y'all, oh, I need my inches. Oh, I don't want to have no ball spot. Like, if you want if you want all that, then how about you go buy you a weave then, bro? How about you go buy you a weave? It's beach plastic stores on every block almost. Go buy you some weave if you that worried about your hair. Like, you're not going nowhere, bro. Everything is closed or... You know, whatever. Like. So, y'all can really get in, get with the program. I'm, I'm doing free haircuts, bro. Free. Free 99. Not even 99. It's just free. Zero, zero, zero. Free. So, all I'm asking y'all is to go on my Instagram. J Cuts Hair will be in the description down below. I'll also leave it in the comments. J go on J Cuts Hair on Instagram, book you an appointment so I can send you the Addy and you come get this haircut. Simple. But anyways, now that I'm done with my little rant or whatever, thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And one more thing. To y'all YouTube supporters out there that supposedly support our channel, where y'all been at, G? Where y'all been at? We posted for a good like 10, 11 days straight for Vlogmas. And y'all left us out here with less than 20 views. Same subscribers count. It's 2021 and we still looking at the same numbers. We get like one new view a day. Come on. Where y'all supporters at, man? It'd be easier to post videos constantly if y'all was around. If y'all was engaging in the videos. If y'all was liking the videos. If y'all was commenting on videos. If y'all was following us on Instagram besides the 52 people that we got on there. Come on. Where y'all at? Y'all gave us that false sense of hope when y'all ran that cooking video up to 500 plus views. Like what was so good about that video? Please tell me so we can redo it. Please tell me. But, yeah, bro, like, all I'm saying is it'll be easier to be consistent if y'all was actually, like, giving us video ideas. Or, you know what I mean? Just some simple stuff like that. Like, it's hard to it's hard to entertain people that's not there. It's hard to entertain a crowd that's not there. The seats are empty. It's like 12 of y'all in there. That ain't clapping, that ain't cheering, that's on a phone. What was the point of y'all coming? But yeah, thank y'all for watching this video, you feel me? Um, thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure y'all go on Instagram, Jcuts Hair, follow me, book yourself an appointment for Saturday or Sunday. Go on Instagram, the.nappykids with a Z, follow us. But the hate is real, G. The hate is real. Alright. Yeah.